Welcome back to 12 News This Morning. I'm joined now by singer Johnny Boyd. And Johnny, you are here in Milwaukee to perform tonight at a fundraiser, right? Yes, I'm playing at the Wilson Center. Are you and, excited or what, what oh, why do you want to get involved? Well, I'm up, I'm, I'm awake in the morning on Saturday morning. That's I'm very unusual. <laughs> but you're not from Milwaukee, but you've no. been here many times. You've performed I here. I have. I've been toured, I've toured quite a bit in my uh, career as a musician. Is that the best part? I mean, what do you enjoy more? Is it recording a CD or is it uh, performing live? What's the live incredible? stuff is the most fun because it's a different audience every night and you get to make an impact, a fresh impact. In the studio, if you're making a studio record, it's just like you're going, you're chipping away at the block until hopefully it's finally finished. And you've captured those live performances in yes. your CD. So tell us about it, Live in Walla Walla. Yes. That's an interesting title. I have, I've released seven studio records in my um, past. This is the first live release I've ever done. And it came about um, when we played a show in Walla Walla, Washington. And we asked the sound men to run a board mix of the show because we were trying some new material that night and he did and it was pretty good and then we listened to it and I really liked the way it felt like the listener was right there on the stage with the musicians. You, I mean you can hear us hooting and hollering and hear us moving around and there's some things that I sing off mic so it comes it kind of sounds like I'm in the back of the stage. It's really sure. it feels like you're, you're like you're right there and it was all impromptu so there's no fixing it. Mm. I mean you just kind of have to go with what you got so it turned out pretty pretty good and that's the reason I decided to release it. Real quick I want to ask you so NPR stated if Frank Sinatra and Johnny Cash had a love child it would be Johnny Boyd. I mean how does it feel to know that when people hear your music <laughs> they think of these icons these legends. Well that's the name of the game is to try to get them to associate you with someone that they know and that, I thought that was a pretty good uh, blending of two. It's pretty I, neat. I don't, you know, there's a, uh, everybody is, every generation has the new Sinatra. Sure. And I'm not the new Sinatra. All right, and your performance is tonight. Thank you so much, Thank Johnny you. Boyd. Thank you. Thanks for having me. All the details on our website at WISN.com. 7.55 right now in 